What's up guys? Welcome to the channel Scuba Travel Adventure. My name is Thomas in the southern Alberta uh, between Nanton and Chain Lakes area. Out with a couple of buddies that are just behind me. The weather is quite beautiful but uh, we're gonna have a pretty crazy and drastic weather change this evening. Right now we're looking at uh, 17 degrees and we're supposed to get minus uh, to minus 17 overnight. Oh, gotta turn around. I think something happened. My buddies, they're lost behind me there. Oh no, they're coming. Okay. So yeah, the, um, it's very windy today. The winds are gusting up to 100 kilometers. It is uh, quite crazy. So we decided to take the chance and go for a spin. I'm not sure. <laughs> How much fun is that going to be? Uh, it was pretty crazy to get uh, up to this point. Uh, on the highway it was just blowing like son of a gun all over the place. And we were uh, going to on the way to Nanton. Uh, that was quite crazy. Here, hopefully between those little hills, it won't be as bad. But uh, it does gust uh, time to time. Uh, it's pretty powerful. Well, at least the dust doesn't stay up long, and that's a good thing. How is it? Is it okay? Yeah, but you will have all day. There we go, this uh, with F650. We're gonna give him some room. So yeah, it's uh, pretty hard to believe that uh, in the evening the temperature is gonna change that quickly to minus seven and minus 17 in the morning. It's uh, crazy, so the springtime is just stupid here in Alberta. One day you're enjoying your beautiful day and uh, riding your bike, another day you're freaking gonna pull out the sled. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you will be able to hear the wind on the camera, even though it's inside the helmet. It is pretty powerful. You're gonna be able to see the flags in front of me. I gotta slow down for my body weight again. You see the flags up front? That's crazy. They almost <laughs> Canada upside down. They, they, they feel like they're all gonna just uh, be blown off the sticks. Check it out how powerful does the wind blowing off the blowing the bikes off all over the place. <laughs> it's uh, insane. And the guy in front of me, Marius, he's uh, first time on his new bike. He just got it. Well, new used uh, bike, new to him. Uh, he was riding with us until now with the with the R1200 RT. And, uh, just a couple of weeks ago, he purchased that F650 uh, BMW. It's a little bit harder for him as uh, we we did the gravel quite a few times. But this shit here is uh, quite loose, so it's kind of uh, making you slide all over the place. But it is beautiful in this area, like uh, I was here a couple of weeks ago. Oh, 
Oh, that was hard to stand up here on that uh, little corner. Kill switch. Oglądałeś się, że gdzie ty jesteś? <laughs> Let's go! Quick bag! I on będzie go ciężko mi obrócić w tą stronę, bo wiatr tak idzie. Well, there we go, the wind was so powerful. I just turned my head around and I freaking wiped out. It's nuts. Wow, I can't believe it. We cannot go fast. It's just to say, just to keep the bike on the road. I scraped it, uh, my crash parts quite a bit. It was, I took a slide on that uh, gravel on the left side. Yeah, it is what it is, adventure. The one is adventure, we have adventure. Wow, this is crazy again. Holy crap. If we will make it through it, then it's gonna be amazing. Wow. Three guys, three idiots decided to go for an adventure at uh, over 100 km winds. That's just stupid, I think. And that was all my idea. I came, with, I came up with this idea yesterday. If it wouldn't be for that bloody wind, it would be pretty gorgeous. So, that's another short break. We can't even hold the bikes uh, standing up here. It's so hard. Wow. Nobody knew. Nobody knew. Wow, look at all these horses. We gotta get off that gravel as soon as possible. Uh, we're supposed to do 80 kilometers on this stuff, but uh, I don't think we can handle that. This is too much. I don't think I ever rode my bike in such a crazy wind. That wind is just insane. That's a pure power. It's like a tornado for God's sakes. What a nice scar on my bike. It won't be a long video, unfortunately, as I expected. <laughs> we did get out. Uh, we accepted the challenge. And this is uh, like riding, riding on this stuff, uh, this wind. It's uh, not even natural gravel riding. Uh, riding. Being blown, uh, always leaning towards one side uh, to fight the wind. 
and then uh, trying to control the bike as it uh, goes through the gravel and the sliding the tires through it well it's uh, definitely a learning experience my buddy he's already there and I'm waiting here for uh, my buddy Marius and I don't want to leave him behind Okay, now we're gonna go with the wind, so it should get a little bit better. Check out that view. Crazy. What a view. Uh, we decided to call the day. I'm not gonna push it anymore and uh, go home. I don't have much of a choice here. I wanted to record some more footage, but unfortunately, it's uh, not doable. You see the lean angle? Like, wow. So, this is it for today, guys. Uh, we wrapping up and uh, heading back home. Another uh, 60 kilometers uh, to get back to Calgary and uh, we're fighting the wind still and as you see uh, Robert in front of me is uh, leaning heavy to the left uh, the wind is just blowing crazy and uh, we made the right choice and uh, turn around we had no choice uh, just uh, go home and uh, take it easy not worth to fight it it's uh, it's fun, but it's uh, not that much fun. Uh, I wiped out uh, and I couldn't even pick up the bike by myself. It was so windy I couldn't stand up uh, by, uh, by the bike and hold it. Uh, my buddy needed to help me. But uh, yeah, it's another experience. Always uh, trying new things. And stay tuned, uh, more videos coming. And if you like the content today, don't forget to hit the like button. Uh, always comment uh, down below. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. That's always appreciated. And thank you all you guys that subscribe to my channel. And uh, staying with me and uh, enjoying those videos that I make. Uh, we have much more coming this year. For now, cheers. And take care. Ride safe out there.